We just want to update the Bahamian public, our, our supporters, on the, the planning stages that we're in for COVID 2013. With just uh, about three weeks left, we're happy to report that all committees are functioning and that everything is in order. We have the athletes all booked into the Paradise Island Resort, um, Paradise, Paradise Island Harbor Resort and Nassau Palm. And we, <laughs> we also want to say that we have booked all the hotels in Nassau for the many supporters that have been coming to, to Nassau for these games. As a matter of fact, as far as accommodations go, we've had to list on our website a number of private homes because the hotels are all full. This is a good indication of the kind of attendance that we're going to be having here for Curve 2013. Uh, as far as our ticket sales are concerned, we again encourage the Bahamian public to get their tickets early because the tickets are going fast. We have uh, many different zones. Some people have worried that all the sections are sold already. That is not the case. There's still many tickets available. Probably some of the choice seats are, have been taken already. But again, if you're interested in getting those, you've got to um, go to the Thomas A. Robinson Stadium uh, box offices to get your tickets early. We just want to let the public know that to date we have 23 of our Caribbean countries that have registered or are committed to coming for these games over 540 athletes and 150 officials. The, the rest of the Caribbean have indicated that they're going to be coming to these games, which are promising to be the best ever. So we're looking for some forward to some exciting games. We want to ask Mike Sands, now president of the B3As, to give us an update on the preparation of Team Bahamas. How is the team looking, Mike? Well, we're excited. You know, our trials will be held on March 15 and 16. That will determine the Team Bahamas um, athletes to Carifta 2013. Our athletes have been training. There have been meets happening every weekend since January 11 here in the facility where the athletes are getting used to the home territory. Um, as we speak, there's the BISS that is taking place. And of course, there'll be a re last week there was the GSSSA. And of course, there were club meets. Uh, last Saturday, we had a special throwers meet because our, our throwing athletes uh, have been a little inconvenienced due to the simultaneous repairs to the facility but several of our coaches undertook a bowl initiative and we had a throwers meet. Uh, there's also one that is uh, being planned for this weekend. And uh, we, so we're trying to cover all the bases. The coaches are very aware of the need to prepare the team for the competition ahead of us and that they, they have to be commended and congratulated for their efforts. Um, March 15 and 16 will be our trials that will determine Team Bahamas, as I said earlier. And on the 17th, we will announce that team the council members, spearheaded by Mr. Jamico Archer, is planning a, a massive um, float parade through the streets of Nassau to uh, introduce Team Bahamas. Uh, we're also considering some other things that will continue to support the efforts. And so, I just want to say to the Bahamas, uh, we must get your tickets today. Don't delay because our other friends and colleagues from Jamaica, Trinidad, and Bermuda have already secured their tickets. And as the chairman has indicated, there's no need for panic because. There are seats available, but the prime, prime seats are going very, very quickly. And so I just want to encourage those persons, the box office is open from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., then again from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. We're also looking at opening the box office on Saturday. Uh, you will hear about that more in the next day or two. But I encourage you to come on down to the Thomas A. Robinson Stadium and purchase your ticket. Um, you can look inside, identify the seating that you want to and bring the family and friends and let us enjoy a wonderful grifter, or as we say, the best grifter ever. I'd like to take this opportunity to recognize uh, and thank the many sponsors that have come for us so far. The um, heading this list, of course, is the Ministry of Youth Sports and Community Affairs and our title sponsor, um, BTC, the, our other major Sponsors include Atlantis, CIBC, JS Johnson, um, Bahamas Business Solutions, Sands Beer, Coca-Cola, Nassau Motors, BEC, uh, and Nassau Underwriters. There are many others, but uh, we'd like to thank those in particular and invite our corporate sponsorship and our public at large to continue to support uh, Career to 2013.
For more information on this, you can go online to our website. We are at www.carifta2013.com.